A case of deadly revenge. Police say an IHOP employee was killed by his girlfriend's ex. The violence played out right in front of customers. Police say the suspect fired several shots yesterday inside the Lancaster restaurant right off 35. News 8's Rebecca Lopez reports. This IHOP remains closed after one of its employees was shot and killed in front of customers and other employees Sunday afternoon. I feel it deep down in my heart. Police say Malik Butcher was killed after his girlfriend's ex, this man, Tadarius Winters, found text messages between them. Police say Winters shot Butcher three times. The girl was shot once. She survived. Life too short for people to be holding grudges for nothing. When something don't even belong to you, you try to hold on to something that don't even belong to you, man. Butcher's friends say he was a track star while at Cedar Hill High School and also in college. The loss is devastating to his friends who say he was the guy everyone in school liked. Like I want my son to grow up to be him, my son to play sports, my son to be the nice person that he was. He was nice to everybody. He was, I don't, know, I don't think I've ever seen Malik be mean. This is one of the last pictures taken of Butcher. He's the one on the far left. His friends say he was working at IHOP while pursuing his dream of being a model. You know, for him to not be able to live out his dreams the way everybody else has, it, it really hurts everybody because he, he deserves better. His roommate and best friend was tearful as he described how outgoing Butcher was, always wanting to make people smile. And I'm going to miss him. Winters is being held on a million dollar bond for murder and a half a million dollar bond for aggravated assault. Police say he turned himself in to the Duncanville Police Department shortly after the shootings. Police and friends say the two men did not know each other. In Lancaster, Rebecca Lopez, Channel 8 News.